Hi fellows and welcome back. I hope all of you are doing well. Today we are going to talk about um, camera feature in Excel and this feature is pretty much similar to uh, watch window feature in Excel. If you have not um, already used that feature, I'm posting a link in the comments and you can have a look at that as well. Um, the video tutorial that I, I recorded for watch window, you can you can have a look at that and, uh, and, and understand what is this. But uh, in simple words, camera tool is a tool that helps you to snapshot a cell and then use it wherever you want. Snapshot means really a snapshot. So first of all, I would introduce you to the tool, how to bring it into your spreadsheet, and then we will see practically how the snapshots work. It's, it's really interesting, fellas, so just stay with me during the course of this video. Um, you you have quick access toolbar on top of your screens. If you don't have it, I'm posting a link for quick access toolbar tutorial as well that how you can enable disable and customize this toolbar as well just click on it and you will find a feature here more commands click on the more commands and you will get quick access toolbar commands to choose from all of them so i will select here for example all commands when i select all commands all commands will be visible and this i have to search now camera and you see this is the camera tool here simply click on add it will bring it as part of your quick access toolbar which means you can access it anytime you like you have it on top of your screen now so fellow so it's very easy to use now camera means that i can snapshot any cell at any given location that i want to so for example i take this snapshot click on it and click on camera button now you can see the plus sign my cursor has turned into a plus sign which means i can paste it anywhere so i click here and i paste this cell here i will make it a little big and and you can drag it and make it big or small if you want it's it's not a problem it's just a snapshot of the cell that we have here now this cell value is dependent on the two other cells so if i change this value somehow you will see the impact shown here as well so for example if i change this this and you can see the numbers have changed so it's not that you can uh, screenshot or capture only one cell you can capture multiple cells as well for example I'll try this one now I will click on the camera tool I will paste it here and there we go both of them can be put in parallel now it's up to your creativity how you can build these kind of sets for your convenience and for for the display and creative uh, kind of a display of, of, of your screens at multiple places so I will leave it up to you uh, but it's not that you can use it only on the same screen but you can also fetch them from the other end as well for example in this screen I have at the very end uh, a couple of numbers these are the numbers like total of 2019 so if i want to snapshot that i can do that also so i will simply snapshot it i will select it i will use the camera tool and i will bring it here at the bottom and you can see the number total number of 2019 now i can see it here not only that i can see monthly but this is at the very end of the screen and i've brought it here now this is because a sum of the values that are here so if i change one of these values the sum on and the total of the sale for 2019 will change at the end which will be reflected here so i will change the number here for example this one and now keep an eye on the totals and you can see here the numbers have changed because at the end the totals have changed now it's not only like this but you can also bring in or take out the numbers from one screen to another so for example i have cost and sales which has been clubbed into other kind of a tabs and i want to see the total impact so you can see it has been summed from the sale and this has been summed from the cost so what i want to see is if i change anything in the sales it will impact here but how will i get to know so i will take a snapshot of this so i will select for example the sale and the cost and the gp total take a snapshot and let's say i post it here so now I have the snapshot of January sale uh, and I want to change it, for example, from here. And you can see the impact once I make any change onto the total, which will be on the other side. 
as well and you can see the numbers have changed so this is another way of fetching uh, your your display or mirror it to another um, spreadsheet or another corner so fellows i hope this was interesting for you i look forward to your creative ideas and if you have created something very interesting do share your snapshots with me in the comments area uh, don't forget to subscribe the channel and like the video and share it with your friends and colleagues i hope you all have a good day and looking forward to speak to you again thank you very much bye bye